is ice and a heart made of stone. But she keeps me alive. She's the beast in my bones. She gets everything she wants when she gets me alone. Like it's nothing. She got two little horns and they give me a little With Van Zant and Tim Bagels just recently forming an alliance, Van Zant knows that he can trust Tim Bagels 100% because Tim Bagels has already proved himself to Van Zant that he is on his side and he isn't going to do anything to jeopardize his life and or to get him arrested by Red Rose or killed, matter of fact. But Tim Bagels, he now has a Diablo police car and he can go out undercover with Van Zandt and take out some of Red Rose's goons. Now, just in a few more hours, they are going to go out and they're gonna to try to take out Lisa Rose. But the thing about it is, whenever they bust someone or get someone arrested, they never go to jail because Red Rose always bails them out. And this is all, this has been a major problem with Van Zandt. This is the only thing that is stopping him that is in his way from getting her off the street and maybe possibly making the street safer for everyone else even the civilians even him because right now it is just a mesh of danger on the streets besides all the street racing but the thing about it with tim bagels going out and going for lisa rose there is going to be a snake nearby protecting her because lisa rose has people watching her back just like red rose does and Lisa Rose is going to be dang near impossible to get to. So you have to make an executive choice. Do you either keep going after her or do you fight the one that's attacking you that's on your own side? Now, let's wish Tim Bagels the best of luck. Good luck, Tim Bagels.
from all the events that have been transpiring over the last 13 episodes the police are now under investigation by the internal affairs now the internal affairs are usually called in whenever there is wrongdoing in the police system and there is a lot of wrongdoing going on in this police system and a lot of people getting away with a lot of stuff now this kind of counts as a win for Van Zant and everybody else but at the same time a lot of police officers are about to lose their jobs they're gonna be put on paid leave until the situation can be handled but this is the thing about it why it's a win because now they can properly arrest people who are out going out killing other people for Red Rose to have complete control over the streets all of the wrongdoing and bull crap that is going on that is about to be tremendously slowed down because the internal affairs are here and they're investigating people and in the police system now but this is a win for Van Zant and Tim Bagels because now they can start properly taking out Red Rose's people they're gonna start small and work their way up to the top of the charts to get them and the reason why is because Van Zant is trying to make the streets a safer place for him so he can race more and the sport kids and everyone else Let's wish Tim Bagels and Van Zant the best of luck as they go out and go try to take out one of Red Rose's goons permanently. Good luck, you guys.
from what we just seen, Red Rose, one of Red Rose's people is gone. They're gone. They can't do, she can't do anything about it. Because if she tries to bail them out, then that'll let them know she's running the whole entire operation. So now, the four kids, they have to play more strategically. They have to be careful in everything that they do and make sure that they don't get arrested and or have multiple people coming after them at once to take them out because Red Rose's people are gathering up in groups now. And that's kind of not good at the same time. But now what's going on is basically a big tug of war. Which side is going to break first? And I'll see everyone in the next video. Peace out.